a rebrand yourself as many times as you need to. Don't ever let somebody keep you in a box. Or not even somebody. Don't keep yourself in a box. Now, as far as rebranding, I feel like this is something that I've come across personally that I wanted to do for myself because I didn't want to still be attached to the basketball player. I played ball since I was seven years old. In that chapter in my life, that journey in my life has completely closed. And it's so crazy, it's so different. But I've come to accept it. And I don't want to be known as just Jay, the basketball player. Like, there's so much more to me, um, so many hobbies and characteristics of mine. But being attached to something that's completely over with, the world would never see it. Or I wouldn't even like allow it to come out myself. So, like for the start of it, when I decided it, I cut my hair. And I'm gonna show y'all my hair more on here, but I gotta get a haircut in two days. So I'm gonna wait for that. Um, but I started with my hair, man. I've had locks since, since college. Like from college on to just recently. I've had locks and I wanted a different look for myself and like I always put myself in a box even as far as that to like I always felt like I needed some kind of hair on my head or I was just gonna be ugly confident shot nothing so when I decided to cut my hair and I decided to cut my hair for me I actually love my hair shorter than I did with the locks so it's like you got to do different things so you can find out what you like and what you don't like. And again, it's hair. It'll grow back. I'm not tripping off of that. But you got to you gotta get out here. You got to experience things so you can find out more about yourself. You know, I know some people are antisocial, but networking and meeting people also brings ideas. Uh, you, you'll pick up something from somebody else or they'll show you something. Um, that you would have never thought that you would like and end up liking it. That's happened to me before. And I just didn't want to be attached to that that J, like that, that basketball player, because it's so much more to me. Um, and I want to show that. So I also just deleted my, well, deactivated my Instagram account that I had 13.5 followers on there, verified. Um, but that's all from basketball. I don't do that anymore, you know? So I even tried to rebrand while I was still on that account as far as archiving my photos and just like trying to change up the whole thing. But it just still wasn't working for me. So I made a new one. Um, Y'all can go follow me on my new Instagram account. And it's just like starting from the bottom and then just seeing a whole another like different side of someone you think you know um, because they've been this person or showed these traits since a child, basically. So I wanted to do that for myself, bro. But I think everybody should take that take that chance. Not saying you have to rebrand yourself. If you're fine and you're confident and you love you the way you are right now, maybe you already did uh, a rebrand, but you don't have to do it. I just felt like I wanted to do it personally, so I decided to. Um, I'm, I'm seeing different things. I'm, I'm following different crowds on Instagram to see different things, um, different, different styles of videos and different type of outfits. And like, I actually like that stuff. I enjoy that stuff, but me a couple years ago, I didn't. So I feel like everything literally in life is a chapter. And you got to know when that chapter is closed, when that chapter has ended, and then you got to move on to the next one. Because, like, if you just hold on to what you you were doing in the past, like, you're going to you're gonna always be in that box, man. You ain't even going to really know yourself. You got to go out and experience different things so you can see different things. And you got to completely learn about yourself which is a beautiful thing. It's called evolving. It's called evolving. We have to evolve as human beings. You cannot just stay the same. 
I personally don't think you, you, you stay the same. Like, there's something else out there that you got to learn. And there's something else out there that you have to see. But it's not comfortable for everybody. Like, some of y'all might just be comfortable with just who y'all are. And that's fine. But for me, not that I wasn't comfortable. But, I, but there's so much more to me that I want to show the world. And... I can build up 20, 100K followers without basketball. Like, I'm my niche. That was my issue, not even knowing my niche, too, a part of the social media world. But I'm my niche. You're your niche. You know? So I just felt like doing doing a little a little changing. And it takes some soul searching, too. When you, you got to do some soul searching. And you got to be honest with yourself. That way you can move on and move on to your next chapter and nine times out of ten that next chapter is beautiful that next chapter is even more better than the one that you had because like i said we're evolving we're growing we're growing and i think everybody needs to grow in every aspect of of your life um but that that starts from within you got to know, only you know when it's time for a change. Um, and I'm not like a completely different person. Like there's still a lot of things that I want to switch up about me. Um, and it's not about really caring what people think, but it's like a reputation and a character. And when I leave this earth, I do want people to say good things about me you know so like that's how I just try to live my life so this rebranding this starting fresh I just had to do it I wanted to do it for me nobody tell me to do it nobody make me do it I just like I said I felt it in me um and it feels good man it feels good man I love my hair I love my look man um just need to get a cut but if you are nervous or you're scared of that change, bro, I promise you, it's going to be a beautiful thing. And just like with everything else in life, you got to try it. You got to try it out so that you know. If you if you try it out and you don't like it, then okay, cool. Keep doing what you was doing. Hopefully, there will be another time that comes where you do finally decide to, you know what I'm saying, rebrand yourself. But do that as many times as you need to as many times as you need to because we're all growing like i said we're all evolving bro if you if you decide to rebrand say you cut your hair you do this you do that and you don't like it and start it over again until you get to where you want to be to your to you to where you're comfortable with yourself and your confidence is through the roof and you just walking around and you happy all the time and that's what it's about so don't let nobody keep you in a box don't keep yourself in a box there's more to everybody's story and it's it's a beautiful side and i can't wait to see mine i can't wait to see mine but you got to start somewhere all right so i thank y'all for watching this video i hope somebody got something from it man like i said earlier i i did start a new instagram and uh i would appreciate it if y'all go from here over to the instagram and follow me on instagram and um I'm starting to be more engaging with, you know, the comments and posting more. And, like, I really enjoy this technology, social, vlogging videos. To Oh, that's another thing. I am going to be dropping more vlogs on the channel. But just right now, like, I come to find out that I love making these sit-down, somewhat motivational videos um, for y'all. Uh, for me as well. But when something's on my mind... I feel like I got to get it off. And if it can help somebody, I'm going to share it on here. So hopefully somebody got, got something out of this, even if it was just one person. Uh, share the video for me, man. Feel free to, free to drop a positive comment. Oh, damn, I'm tripping. Feel free to drop a positive comment. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. If you are not subscribed, subscribe. I got more videos for y'all. And if you are, I already appreciate it. All right, so y'all have a blessed day, and I'll see y'all in the next video.